Hello and welcome back. This is Ursa Die Gamer, and I am back with Bramble the Mountain King. And I think I'm getting close to the end of this journey. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty confident in that. This is the mountain we're supposedly supposed to get to, and oh good. I thought everything looked a bit too lush at first. There's all the decay and badness. Oh, I thought that was blood. <laughs> or maybe it is. Oh, that is blood. Oh, well then. I have my light. Leave me be. Ha, ah, the music's intense. Is that a skull over there or a stone? Kind of looks like a skull. It's probably a stone, though. Wait, what? Am I back in the, like, hallucination thing where I always go back to this mountain top? Yeah, I think that's where I am. Oh, and those are quite... reached the summit, Ola felt regret. Those are quite big. Oh, okay. Regret that he could not stop his sister from being taken. Regret that he could not stop the woman from drowning her child. We did try. To be honest, I don't know why that's a bad thing since she was killing people and luring them to their deaths and tried to do that to me, which, you know, I I took offense to. Now the mountain stood before him, and he wished he could ask their forgiveness. Oh. This is cool. Yeah, we're covered in blood. That's wonderful. That's good. Love the stonework. Like, looks real nice. He had reached the end that Tuva had pointed him towards. Now, entering the halls of the mountain, Ulle was ready to find his sister. Yeah, I'm prepared. Can't look any further that way. What am I looking for exactly? Whoa, that is a high ceiling. Oh. Ooh, secret tunnel. 
Could I do anything with this one? No. Okay. Yep, I found... Ooh, books! Is it the librarian again? Don't tell me you're going to hurt me now. I thought we were buddies. We are buddies, right? Oh, hey, yeah, we're buddies. We're good. I get to learn more story stuff. Exhausted, bloody, and at his wit's end, King Nils came to a witch's house on the outskirts of his kingdom. He fell to his knees, begging the witch to help cure his son, and she agreed. The witch explained that the flower held tremendous power that could only very carefully be used for good. And if you're not careful, you cursed everybody. The witch instructed he only use a single petal. Using the whole bloom would only invite death. Ulrich began to recover but discontent at the royal line had grown in the kingdom, following King Nils' bloody campaign. Well, yeah, kind of went on a whole murdering spree there, King. Not the smartest move. The next day, King Nils found his son dead, and the last light holding his darkness at bay was snuffed out. Well, that's unfortunate. It's not the kid's fault. The dad's basically crazy. Heartbroken, King Nils turned to the bloom which had promised life, and instead saw it as an escape from his suffering. Oh. The witch, having come to visit the king and the prince, looked at the nightmarish scene in despair. She raised a mountain on top of King Nils and shackled him using the same bramble that he let loose upon the kingdom. That's pretty impressive. Conjure a whole ass mountain on the guy. Is that supposed to be Tuva then? Kind of looks similar to her. To this day, the trolls still feed him as punishment for his evil deed. Ah. Okay, what does this book have to say? Long ago, there was a piece of... Oh, okay, yeah. Already read that book. So no new info there. Hey, bud. Ooh, there's something. Is that? Yeah, that's my buddy! <laughs> Alright, I'll see you later, buddy! I was worried he was going to murder me. Ooh, that is dark. Okay, lots of stuff to look at. Ooh, what's that? Ah, uh, I'm in the prince's room, am I? So, this is the castle. You know, honestly, taking this knife as some means of self-defense would be a good idea. Hell, even this would work. Not very efficiently. But it would still be better than nothing. And a sculpture of the king. Ah, good. Hmm. 
Like, I do feel bad for the king. I probably wouldn't be much better in his situation, but... It shouldn't have killed all those people that could have potentially helped you. Not the smartest move. Okay, what do you want me to look for here? I can't open this. Oh, I'm jumping while I'm looking at the item. Huh. I like to... Oh! Ah. Uh. I don't think I should have put on his clothes! Oh. Okay. That's for the clock. Look at me! I am princely! The royalty. <clears throat> okay, can't open that, so I have to figure out the clock then. Which... Could be anything. All right, no, that's not gonna work. So, I'm missing a clue. Probably in the paintings, if I were to guess. Oh, chalice, uh, little jar thingy, and the sword. Okay, so, chalice, you see, I'm smart, it may take me a while to get there, but I'll get there. Now, I'm looking for a number somewhere on here probably, right? Oh, there it is, ah, uh, that would be six. Six. Six, two. Six, two, ten. Okay. Six, two, ten. Ha ha! What fell? A ah, key. Nothing else to look at. No. Okay. I'm so glad I have this little light. Uh, all right, I feel like I should be concerned. I was pretty sure I heard heavy breathing. Maybe I'm mistaken. Okay. That looks like a throne. If it is, he's a big guy. <laughs> This way? Oh! Okay. Alright. Alright, he didn't wake up. That's good. 
He might if the lightning disturbs him too much. Or whatever that was. What is that? Is that a forge? I think I mistimed this. Oh, I'm good. Ha. Ah. That is a cool forge. Let's go. Okay. This ain't too bad. A leap. And leap. Yeah, we did it. Now the next part. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, no. That almost got me. Oh, oh no. Oh, it is not giving me a lot of breathing room. <laughs> I got lucky there. Oh no! My knees! And there. This time I made it. And let's go! Yeah! Okay, we gotta move carefully. We're almost out of danger. Ha <laughs> ha. Yeah. That is a cool looking door. Like, real neat. Um. Ah, I see. I banished the. Away! And allow my passage through. The gate that was meant to be closed forever, now opened. That may have been a mistake. Is that you, sis? You okay? Oh, I see... Oh, yeah, that is his head. You a big boy. Is that your crown up there, too? Mm. Am I too late to save her, is the question I'm wondering. The Mountain King, who was meant to be hidden forever, was now revealed. He just had to reach the sack before Lilimur ended up as the giant's dinner. Yeah, that sounds like it'll be easy peasy. After all, I have to go around in front of him, of course, not climb up the backside. That's a neat looking sword you got there, too. Do you mind if I take it? I imagine I have to. Yeah, avoid the light, right? Well, maybe not. We're gonna step proudly and boldly into the light. Cause yeah, that's gonna work out well, isn't it? Don't mind me. Am I climbing this? I am climbing his sword, wonderful. If he's napping, that's good. He can stay napping. Okay. Now we just gotta make our way around. 
Whew. <laughs> I thought I fell. Don't set them off when I ping this flower. Oh. Oh, good. Sis, I need you to be quiet just for a second here, okay? Where are you taking her? Are we really just gonna stand here? Oh. Oh, God. Yeah, really not good at the saving people thing. Hey, King. That's neat. Ah. Oh, whoa. No stabby. Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh, jeez. Okay, let's not get stabbed again. Whoa, whoa! <laughs> ah! Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> that was close. Oh, you almost got me again. Whoa. Oh, jeez. You're very quick with that knife. Okay, one shoulder done. Whoa, ooh. No. Come on, give me that. Yes. All right. Oh, now you're getting the sword, are you? Okay. Oh, and I see you got a staff too. Wonderful. Oh. Okay. I need to get up. I need to blast the flowers some more. Oh. Oh, shoot! Ahaha! <laughs> Just 
jump, jump! Whoa, that almost got me! See where it's gonna fall! You're getting too smart for me, my guy. Whoa. Whoa. Oh no, that got me. Whoa. I did not expect the backswing. I'm so glad I jumped to my own death. <laughs> oh! Got you! But the bramble weakened. The Mountain King saw clearly for the first time in centuries. And what he saw reminded him of his beloved son. He would not lose him again. Okay. This time, King Nils would overcome the darkness. Okay, am I running away from it or towards it? All right, uh, did you kill my sister? I have a feeling you killed my sister. The source of the curse blossomed. Maybe we can save her with the flower. Hey, Kingy. King Niels tore the bramble rooted in his back and brought it all to an end. Whoa! The only way to get to Lilimur was now up and in. Okay, this is a plan, I guess. Don't know how much of a good plan it is, but it is a plan. Ah, okay. Hey, Kingy. Ah. Uh. I don't know if this is really that good of an idea. Oh, oh no. Oh, you're alive, sis? Well, that's good. Good for you. Don't think Ole is now. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think he is.
Tuva had one last gift to give to Ole. Well, we got lucky there. Yeah, I, every bone in. Talking dead. His prison started to crumble. <laughs> Buddies! Always look after his friend. Frightened by her memories, she searched for her brother's comfort. Oh, what? But he was nowhere to be found. Ole, wh why would you run off now? Well, that seems to be lacking quite a few creatures, if I remember correctly. Oh, we got to keep all the figurines, though it looks like I'm missing two, which doesn't surprise me. Oh, Ole got taller. So this has been some time then, right? I can't look at that. We still got the book over here that we read before. No, it's gone. Can't look in the chest. Also can't go through the door. So the window is the only answer. However, the darkness outside did not scare her. She knew she had her brother. Well, that's nice. Well, that was quite a fun game. That was really cool, too. Very pretty. But yeah, I'm glad we actually managed to save our sister instead of failing like we have in so many other ways. <laughs> But anyway, as I was saying, yeah, I'm so glad we could actually save the sister. Because if she had died, I would have felt really terrible. But we did manage to save her, and Ole came out alive, which is great. But if you like this game, I highly recommend you try it out for yourself if you haven't already. And if you liked watching me play through it, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next journey.